Hey, I'm Mr. Lefkoe. I'm the ceramics and sculpture teacher at Dalton High School. I think a lot of people like to make stuff that you can actually use. Like we do a lot of pottery stuff, like putting cups and, and bowls and, and things like that that you can actually use in your life. And I think people really enjoy those kinds of things. What is your favorite part about showing up to this class every day? Um, it's really laid back and I like expressing myself artistically. Uh, Mr. Leffert is a really cool teacher, so we we'll probably have a good time in here. What is something you've learned <laughs> throughout, the, throughout the years here and, uh, as you've taken this class? We have it's really helped me to like, better myself as an artist and it really lets you like get more creative with your work and like he makes you experiment more. Uh, lots of different clay making techniques and how to make all sorts of different ceramic figures and stuff like that. Would you encourage other students to take this class? Uh, most definitely. Mr. Ledford is the coolest teacher. It's lots of fun. I wanted to talk to you a minute about some of the things that we do in uh, Drawing and Painting 1. We do painting, we paint with acrylics and temperas and watercolor, and in drawing we work with charcoal, color pencils, oil pastels, ink, um, you name it, we do it. This is the main classroom and this is where you would start as a drawing and painting one student. And uh, this class here is drawing and painting two. But we're using the room because they're doing things that are very flat, so we use the tables for that. This room here is, um, as you can see, we have a lot of uh, easels, and this is where students will work from like a still line on the, ta on the tables there, and they'll work at easels. Like I can fit a whole classroom in here, and they can all be working on easels. And it's a lot of fun. Miss Kinsey's really nice, and we got she teaches us how to do different things like painting and drawing. This is a really fun class and it teaches you how to draw better. And Miss Kinsey's really, really nice too. It's easy and you'll have a really great time in it. It also helps you get your skill level up, I guess you could say. I hope to see you next year. Bye. Uh, hi, I'm Mr. Finney. I'm the drama teacher and drama director here at Dalton High School. Well, we have three drama classes right now. We have Drama 1, uh, Drama 2, and Drama 3. In Drama 1, we basically learn uh, just the fundamentals. In Drama 2, we, we get a little more into um, learning acting techniques and things of that nature. And in Drama 3, we do all kinds of independent projects and, and, and different kind of things that um, that build on what you learned in Drama 1 and Drama 2. Any, any student at all, uh, they don't have to be in Drama Club. They don't have to be uh, in, in a drama class. They can come audition for one of our shows. We do three shows a year. Uh, we do the one-act competition play in the fall. We do the winter play in uh, January of every year. And we also do the spring musical uh, in April of every year. Uh, so those are three opportunities uh, to come and, and be on the stage here at Dalton High School. We also uh, have a thespian troupe, an international thespian troupe uh, here, and we attend the uh, Georgia Thespians Conference every February, and that's like a, a three-day conference in Columbus, Georgia. We take about 30 or 40 students with us. And, um, all the high schools all over the state bring their thespian troops as well, so there's a lot of kids interested in drama at that uh, convention. I'm David Henry. I'm the band director here at Dalton High School. You know, we're most known for the music that we make. Uh, all the musical um, attributes that a performer needs to know. We're teaching performance. We're teaching literacy, how to read music. Um, and there's a lot of correlation that people don't probably think about between a lot of other classes, like language, uh, science, the science of sound, things like that.
of the downbeat because the baton's moving straight down on beat one. So if you're holding that half note and you're not sure if the next thing is beat four. The work ethic, you know, particularly these guys that do marching band, they work really, really hard. We push them really hard. And uh, the hope is, is that when they get into the workforce and they have a tough job in front of them, that they're up to the challenge because they've, they've been pushed and they've worked hard and they've reached goals and they know how to set goals and work for them. And uh, I just think a person that's a member of any team, whether athletic or band or anything of the sort, has got a, uh, an advantage in the workforce when they get a job. My name is Dr. Andy Baker and I teach choral music at Dalton High School. In my class we do three big performances a year. We learn choral music, we sing with choreography, we learn about how to act on stage, we learn how to project your voice. We learn how to present yourself in public so that you make a good impression, and we learn how to work together in a team. When students leave my class, I would love for them to take away an appreciation of different kinds of music, and I would like for them to take away great memories of the shows that we've done together, the hard work that we have put in, and the payoff for putting in all of that hard work.